Hello friends, Archangel with Crypto Angel here. In this Frequently Asked Questions video, we are going to examine how we can remove or protect ourselves from out of gas failed transactions. So in order to do that, first we need to make sure that we select our MetaMask extension. And by clicking the globe in the upper right hand corner and going to settings, and we'll click advanced. Scroll down until you see advanced gas controls and make sure that toggle is on. So with that, we'll go ahead and initiate a transaction to run this test scenario. We'll select bone and do 0 0.001 Ethereum. We're not going to complete this transaction. This is mainly so we can examine the gas controls. So we're going to click swap and confirm swap. And now we've got our manual dashboard for the gas controls. So typically you would come in here and just select edit and pick average or fast. If this were a normal uh, day in the Ethereum network. However, with Shiba swap launching, no day is a normal day in the Ethereum network. And these fees are actually pretty low. So, we're going to go ahead and click fast. However, this is notoriously deceptive in that sometimes we'll see gas fees around $12, $11. However, they may spike in between us selecting that fast fee and clicking the confirm button. And so our transaction will sit on the network and then we get a notification that our transaction has failed due to the due to being out of gas. So here we've got the gas price, which is this 1148. And then we've got our gas limit. So the way I like to think about these is your gas price is kind of like the needle on your speedometer while your gas limit is like the speedometer numbers. So even though your car can, shows that it can go up to 120 miles per hour, 200 kilometers an hour, you're usually not maxing that out at that limit. So with this gas price, think of that as the needle that says, hey, I want to stick it 50, 55 miles an hour or 100 kilometers an hour. So this is the desired price that we want to select here. However, to to make sure that we cover any slippage in gas fees that may occur or gas price spikes, we want to up this number as much as we're comfortable with. So we'll go ahead and type in for now 350,000 way. And you can see that that brings up our number to 2588. And because I've seen this happen before, I may bump that up to 400,000. And because most of the time, $30 is enough to cover anything that's going through right now. So with that, this doesn't mean that this is the price we're going to pay. Again, this is our desired price right here. However, this is to cover any price between this price and our max. So if we hit confirm, then while, while our transaction is processing on Etherscan, you'll see this number is the gas fee. But once that transaction is fully processed, you'll see this number as the gas fee. So it may end up being, again, that $11 or $14, somewhere in that range. So I hope this information is helpful to you. And if you have any questions about how to overcome a failed transaction due to out of gas, please leave it in the comments. And with that, Archangel out.